as i have already told purpose of routing algorithm or purpose of routing is to find shortest path between source and destination so two important point to remember in distance vector algorithm is every node in routing algorithm knows two thing first about its neighbor its neighboring node and second thing about total node in one topology in one autonomous system or let's say one topology i will come to the autonomous system i will cover what is autonomous system soon so let's skip topology right now so to elaborate this two term let's take one example so if distance vector routing algorithm is used a knows about b c but a is not knowing about d but a knows there are four node including a what b knows b knows about a b knows about c b knows about d b knows about b d knows about c and d knows there are four nodes including d and similarly c so will on basis of that information they will create their routing table they will share their routing table and after some time whole routing table is created so let's let's talk about how this routing table is created at each node let's take very simple topology this is the weight of link so what this weight or what this cost represent this cost may be delay may be noise of channel distance be distance between two node so this cost is composed of all this factor there are many more factor to count this delay so this delay is composed of all this factor that will define or or you can say that distance between two node so uh, on basis of this delay routing algorithm will create routing table so as i have already told let's create routing table at 1 so what a knows or what one knows one knows about every node in same topology or in one autonomous system that is 1 2 3 what other thing one knows about neighboring node only so neighboring node of one is 2 and 3 so distance by 7 and distance from 1 to 1 is 0 i can keep this and distance from 1 to 3 is infinite so at a routing table is created in such a manner and there is one another hola that is next hope so what is next hope right now next hope for one is destination so for one next hope is one so i can keep dash or i can keep the same value as this similarly routing table at node 3 will be created same manner distance from 3 to 1 is infinite no direct link between 3 to 1 though there is indirect link but there is no direct link so 3 is not knowing about 1 as i have already told 3 is knowing about neighboring node only distance between 3 to 
टू स्टैंड इंटरमीडिएट नोवर डेज टू डिस्टेंस बिटवीन थ्री टू थ्री जीरो आई कैन गिव डैश और थ्री बोथ आर करेक्ट डिस्टेंस बिटवीन थ्री टू फोर इज सेवन एंड नेक्स्ट नोट और डेस्टिनेशन नोट इज फोर सो सिमिलरली रूटिंग डबल एट एवरी नोट इज क्रिएटेड लाइक वाइज थैंक यू हेलो एवरी वन यू माइट हैव नोटिस दैट आई हैव चेंज वैल्यू ऑफ वन टू थ्री फोर फ्रॉम ए बी सी डी एंड अदर थिंग दैट आई हैव चेंज दिस दैर इज थर्ड कॉलम दैट इज नेक्स्ट होप राइट नाउ नेक्स्ट होप इज डेस्टिनेशन होप दैट्स वाई यू कैन से दिस बोथ कॉलम आर सेम बट वैन टेबल और वैन आई कैन वैन वी कैन से रूटिंग टेबल इज सेट बिटवीन टू नोट दिस वैल्यू माइट गेट चेंज so now let's take scenario when c said it's routing table to a so what c says a b c d post in finite 10 0 and 7 a will not send next of column of its routing table to i i mean c will not send next of column of its routing table to a in earlier scenario like uh, bandwidth was very less so the scientists they, they who have developed this routing algorithm their prime focus was to save bandwidth as well so they are they are sending minimal minimum amount of data that uh, that can perform the task well and uh, you know the meaning of distance vector in computer science vector is array vector is array and dist array of distance is said in distance vector routing algorithm so array of distance so this value is said in distance vector algorithm that's why this routing algorithm is known as this distance vector routing algorithm so only this value is said so c says this value to a but we can let's take there is one direct connection between a to c that is 3 so this value will get changed 3 again this value will get changed this 3 again this value you will get changed now a a has information about neighboring node and this table that is said by c third important thing to routing in distance vector algorithm is new routing table table is formed according to routing table of neighboring node only previous routing table will not help in creating new routing table so once this data is said don't rely on this routing table remember this point this point will help you in count to infinity problem so forget about this table new routing table is created a b c B. A to A zero dash A to B A to B there is one direct connection between A to B. I will represent direct connection by direct arrow, and uh, you can go from A to C and C to B. A is not knowing how C is uh, C is leading A to B. so i have mentioned this line from curly i'm using curly line so direct connection from a to b is 5 a to c is 3 and c will carry b using 10 so that is 10 plus 3 30 there is direct connection from a to c second possibility is A to C direct connection and C to C direct connection. So this will be zero. 
so it will be same as a to c what is direct connection between a to c 3 i'm writing value of d over here because there is no space you can go from a to d directly or you can move from a to c because you are knowing there is direct link between a to c and there is indirect link between a to d so a to c is 3 and c will carry a to d using distance of 7 so that is 10 and a to d direct link is 7 so minimum of these two will be considered as value of root integral Routing table at point A. So, what is the value taken at A? 0. Next stop is A. For B, minimum value is 5. And what is next stop? Again, B. At point C, minimum value is 3. And next stop is C. At point D, minimum value is 7. And again, next stop is D. So in this scenario, routing table is not changed. So we will take another example where you can see change in routing table. Actually, this method is very lengthy. We are not supposed to use this method when we are actually finding routing table. So this for con conceptual understanding, this actually routing table is formed in such a manner. So for finding routing algorithm at, at point A and finding distance from A to B, it will do like A to B direct link and it will find the cost of direct link and second possibility is path one link from A to C because C has set its routing table or C has stated vector of distance that is array of distance to A so A has information of distance vector of C so direct link between A to C and indirect path A is not knowing how C will carry him to B but he is knowing C has some value that can lead A to B. So this way we can create distance vector at point A. Similarly, every node will share its routing table to another node and this process will continue for some time and routing table will be formed. After once saturation point is or once efficient routing table is created, data will be shared using this routing table. After periodic update, periodic update is like in router, one timer is set, let's say 5 minutes. So after 5 minutes, again every node will set its routing table. If there is change, routing table will be changed or routing table will be updated. And if there is no change, routing table will be keep, routing table will keep as it is. So in distance vector routing, routing algorithm, at every 5 minute or at every specific period, link will be utilized or we can say link will be wasted in sharing routing table so this point you can note thank you